Hello everyone, welcome back to My Diamond Addiction. This is Valerie. In this video, we are going to do a review of a kit that I got started and completed not too long ago. Um, this is Crystal Butterfly Pink. I did the unboxing of this um, a couple weeks ago. And let me give you the details here. I ordered this on April 17th. It shipped on April 30th. It arrived to me May 14th. I started it and finished it on May 16th. So here it is. Look at that. It's actually very, very pretty. Um, I got this one from E Cool Buy, and this one I have listed as free, so it must have been like buy five get one free. So I got this one for free. The size is thirty by forty, although when we measured it, it wasn't actually thirty by forty, um, which is why it got a nine out of ten on unboxing because of the size difference. So let's go ahead and talk about this kit a little bit. The glue on this was great. Uh, a lot of times when you get these crystal kits, the glue on them, I find, you stick a diamond down and then they tend to slide really easily. I didn't experience that with this one. Uh, this one went, this one worked out really nice. Uh, so the glue was, was good. They'll go ahead and get the two points for the glue. Extra point for dog hair, the joys of owning a dog. There we go. Um, the drills, the drills were fine. Obviously, I mean, you had some that the silver coating that goes on the back was put on the top, so they were upside down. But there is the the containers, and you can see. I think there are extra drills. In all of them there were plenty the only one that there wasn't extra was this one um, and this one was these two drills right here right there and right there and because I only needed two they only gave me two but they were they were fine it completed the kit um, so I didn't I didn't need a bunch of extras so they will go ahead and get the two points for the drills there was some trash. You will have trash with the with the crystal kits, uh, but it wasn't wasn't anything I wasn't expecting. The symbols were they clear and easy to follow? Oh yeah, the symbols are the symbols are really good. They were really easy to distinguish what was what, so they'll get the point for that. The picture versus the final product. Well, there's the final product. And I will insert a picture of what it looked like here. And then you can decide. I think it looks great. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and give them the two points for that. And the enjoyment. Did I enjoy doing this project? I really did. It worked up beautifully. Um, the end product was good. Putting the drills down was good. They didn't slide all over. This was just a really good munchy sized piece. Uh, did it while we were watching probably SWAT or Joe Kenda on the TV. So for final scoring or completion scoring, I will go ahead and give it a 10 out of 10, um, which makes overall score for this kit 9.5 out of, out of 10. I see no reason if you like this. Um... I would recommend buying it. It turned out great. Again, this is from E Cool Buy. If you didn't see the unboxing video, I will link it up in the eye, whichever corner the eye goes in, so that you can see the unboxing of this and the other kits that I got from, from E Cool Buy. Now I want to. I did a kit up of this video of when I kitted this up. 
Um, and I used the new little 12 slot containers. 12 slot container that I had unboxed. I will also put a link to that video if it's not the same video up in the eye. Um, so let's talk about this little 12 slot thing right here. This is extremely small. I mean, there's there it is in my hands. It's extremely small, um, but it was perfect for doing a kit like this. It took up, you know, this much room. Example, there's the big, the large white tray. So it's barely bigger than the large white tray as far as wide goes. That's the size of this little thing. Um, so it took up that much room on my little table. Then I had my diamond painting and my tray and it worked so well. The lids on these are awesome. They don't come off. They don't squeak when you put them on and off. If you do partials and smaller kits, um, I would definitely recommend these. These are great. I didn't have any, any issue with those at all. Uh, sometimes when you get some of these, the lids don't, don't fasten securely. Um, they tend to loosen, whatever. These are all, see, I even just chucked it and they still stuck together. So yeah, I will put a link to these down in the description box, a link to this in the description box. And I would, I would recommend these. These worked great. I'm actually going to, when I de-kit this and take all of the, yep, brain fart. When I take all the magic marker off these and get it all to where it looks like it has, doesn't, hasn't had anything in it, oh my gosh. When I get it looking like new, I will uh, kit up something else in it. So when I de-kit this, I'll show you how I de-kit things and get all the numbers off of here. Although numbered 1 through 12 was just fine for this kit because it just coincided with this. Who knows? Depends on what the next one looks like. I may just leave the 1 through 12 on there. We'll figure it out when we decide what we're kitting up. Okay, I have rambled enough. If you have any questions or comments please leave them in the comment section down below i thank you all for watching and subscribing and i will see you in the next one bye